Chad Gable, big opportunity here tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. The Minnesota native is scratched and clawed for everything he's earned in his life. Represented the United And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 270 pounds, Holland Albright. Singles action on its way, and it sounds like this arena is more than ready to kick this one off. So is social media, Michael. The opening bell hasn't even rung, and yet both these superstars are already trending. Here we go. Come on, negotiations have broken down and we now have to, a war on our hands. Yeah, they couldn't wait to get a hold of each other. What a stomp, good grief. Using the elbow as a weapon. Singles action is underway and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, Ouch. it's hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. We got a cover. And Chad Gable quickly kicks out. Nah, no, not yet. Too early. Side. This might be it. Oh, my. Chad Gable not looking so good. Well, we all know that he isn't afraid of a good fight, which is what we're seeing here. Oh, what impact. Beautiful technique. Oh. <laughs> Harsh impact. Oh, what impact. All this demoralizing damage to Chad Gable. How can he take the upper hand here? If he's not careful, this can snowball out of control wow. for him in a hurry. The amount of punishment he's absorbed in this match is oh. slammed with authority. No doubt about that one. Things just went from bad. He's got him covered. A kick out. This one's not over yet. Well, I'm not surprised Gable kicked out there. That's what Olympians do. Keep your eye on this one. Look at this. Elbow drop with authority. Oh, and a 
gets a reversal. Oh. Mm, nice back rotation suplex. Chad Gable is in position. to the lower back. And what a reversal from Chad Gable. Oh. Here we go. Nail it. Chad Gable is getting a serious beatdown. Not sure how much more anyone would be able to take. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this match. Now is the time for Chad Gable to find a way to shift into that extra gear. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He looks to be a little surprised right now. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I can tell you with all certainty that he did not anticipate his opponent mounting any sort of comeback here. And it looks like he was wrong. Very wrong. What a match! Knows what's gonna happen. This match could go anywhere. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Chad Gable doing a great job of turning that around. Oh man. You gotta wear your opponent down. Find that little weakness that could help you end up with a victory. Suplex! Gable was a Minnesota State High School wrestling champion. From there, Chad competed in NCAA competition as a member of Northern Michigan University and then followed his dream to the 2012 Olympic Summer Games. Chad spent almost his entire life competing in some form of wrestling. I need to point out that Chad Gable is from Minneapolis, Minnesota, which is widely known as a breeding ground for incredible athletes, especially amateur wrestlers and sports entertainment superstars. Anyway, you look at it, Chad Gable is one of the most technically gifted, physically strong, and resilient superstars in this or any other era in WWE. And that's saying a whole heck of a lot. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. And the instinct from Gable on display. So quick. Tick. Hoping to end it here. This is it. No trouble getting out of that one. Oh, wow. Look at this, the suplex. He's not looking good here. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. Harsh impact. Backbreaker. This is going to be big. 
one way or another. Oh, look at this. I don't know how these superstars are doing it right now. They've got to be exhausted. I don't know how much more damage one person could take. I don't care how tough you are. Six. And the instinct from Gable on display. So quick. Seven. Back now inside the ring. Looks like both these superstars have found that little extra something to keep themselves going here tonight. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. to lose. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Here he goes. Oh, incoming. Feeling happy. Oh, 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 what a scary drop. That might be all she wrote for Chad Gable. The shoulders are down. What is keeping this competitor going? Oh, that was close. Byron's feeling happy. Oh, oh, oh. Face buster. Man. That was vicious. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Yes! Takes it! Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. That's the kind of match that makes me proud to be here at ringside. Action from the opening bell and a finish people won't soon forget. These superstars gave as good as they got, and these fans got their money's worth from the opening bell. Here is your winner, Holland Albright. Nicely done, picking up the win here. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. The crowd here tonight, sir. Now look at we all knew this situation was going to explode sooner rather than later. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. When this guy's on, look out. He looks for it once again. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. That might be all she wrote for Chad Gable. Things just went from bad to worse for Chad Gable.